Alrighty, good morning everybody. It is the Dark Comic Nerd. Happy Sunday to everybody. Um, currently at the time of this recording, I am actually uploading the video from yesterday. I'm about a day behind on all my videos, so it's been weird, but nobody's really been watching them from what YouTube's analytics are telling me, so I don't think I'm hurting anybody's feelings. Um, so what we're doing today, guys, is something I mentioned in the previous video, and by the time I upload this later, so there actually might be two videos uploaded today, one in the morning that's from yesterday, and this one that will probably be uploaded sometime this afternoon and later tonight. So it'll look like there was two of them, but really the last one was done on Saturday, and this one is done on Sunday. And the thing is, is that uh, what's going on is, is that they introduced two new characters, and they're not new, but they're new to the banner, or they're new to the event would be more specific, to the lineup of characters. One is Queen Meb, which I don't have. One is Alter Coup, which I don't have. And still, there is Tiara here, um, <clears throat> which I still have not been able to get because we got a spook yesterday, as we are going to all know, I hope, by the time we watch this. Um, I got another Cersei, stupid as could be. I, I think I'm getting missed luck of getting just nothing but um, the same um, caster over and over and over again. It's weird. So what we're going to do, guys, is because of lack of time, and because I said in the last video I was going to be looking at how they were going to do this, and they're giving each one of these their own banner, which is actually pretty convenient for me because then I can roll on each one of them without taking the chance of having the wrong um, five-star show up. Now, most people would say, oh, well, if you get to roll on a banner that has all the five-stars on it, you take a chance of one roll giving you um, two of the five stars. And it's like, yes, if I believe that I had the luck of the gods, nobody really gets two five stars. It does happen occasionally, but for the most part, it doesn't happen very often. So having them one at a time probably is going to bode for me a little better. But we'll see what happens, guys. I have a lot of quartz. Uh, I'm going to probably try to do my usual ritual but we're not gonna try too too hard we're just gonna do a few of them put in a good effort and then try a one shot on each one of them to see if we can get the five star in question i'm expecting a big fat goose egg that's fine um but you know we'll see what happens <clears throat> there they are, my two casters. My gosh, they're not worth much of anything. I've already NP'd that woman. <clears throat> As you guys know, a lot of times the first one of the day tends to be a super. It uh, doesn't always happen as a guarantee, but it's been known to happen quite often lately, which is why sometimes I'm very particular about who I do for a servant. Uh, so with that luck in mind, we're going to go after the new one, the new, new, new one first. <laughs> Saw that pause. Though I've seen many a pause lately turn out to be nothing. And the fact that it showed up as a caster already has me concerned. <clears throat> Event? No, I guess the pauses today are a little off. We're not seeing a lot of event CE, if this is what we're popping up with. That was a longer pause. I'm waiting to see what that's going to turn out to be. At least it wasn't a caster. Ooh. 
So just jack the volume all the way up, guys. My apologies if it's too loud. I'm, I think I'm having problems with my ears this morning because the, there's a weather system coming in. And I think it's uh, already screwing with my sinuses. Uh, could also be because it was very, very cold last night, so my heat ran a lot. So my ears, I think, are a little clogged. My nose is a little messed up. This roll looks like it might be a big fat bust. I don't think we've seen, we've seen a couple four stars, I think, right? One or two at least, but the same four star. What a piece of junk. Yeah, two four stars and and that only CE and it would have been better if they were the event CE. So it wasn't bad, but it you would think getting two four star CE would mean that it was pretty much a mediocre. But the fact that they were the same one and just looking at overall what else I got, I didn't even rate getting the Ushiwaki Maru. Apparently, uh, just does not look well. I'm really hoping for better. In the other two, but I'm concerned. I'm a bit concerned because it's looking like it might be a lousy morning for doing stuff like that. I do not know for sure, but uh, something just screamed high. We're going to screw you over. All right, we'll keep going down this route with her. Oh, actually, we probably need to. Um, Okay, we're going to put the volume back down a little bit because when Da Vinci talks there, gosh, it's just like nails down a chalkboard for me practically. <laughs> All right, let's go with the Hellfires that we had from here. Um, and then we're going to actually start diving into the other ones by accident. Let's pull from the top one. It's going to completely fill up our box. All right, let's do this. <clears throat> let's give at least one hellfire. interesting guys if they did a thing in the game where every time you did the first um exp um what do i want to call it boost of the day you always got a super success i wonder if they would do ever think about doing that where it's like it's and if how people would use it would be really cool if they could like guarantee the very first time you do one of these in a day would always be a super. That would be amazing. We got plenty of hellfire, so I'm going to keep using that. And we're going to do one more, guys, for good measure, and then we're going to roll. So we're going to actually use the rest of these up. I'll have to refill when I do the next time. Yeah, I have a hunch this doesn't bode well. Uh, I'm going to tell you guys, I do want to roll... Yeah, I hit that one wrong. I'm thinking of too many things that start with the letter S. Um, I'm going to do Meb here you're next. If the roll turns out to be very, very, very bad, I might stop for the day and not even go after Cool. Well, I might stop for this run and not even go after Cool Alter and maybe do a separate video later. Well, there we go. At least it's not starting. Out. 
a lot of people say if you get this card, the rest of the run is going to be pretty bad. So I guess we'll have to wait and see. All right, it looks like we're on a four-star gotcha run here. Okay, that could turn out bad. Those are the two, in my opinion, once you get those two, they're the two crappiest four-star CE you can pretty much get dumped on you. Okay, now we're getting doubles. I don't know whether I should be happy or not. All I see is for, all I see is EXP fodder for my for my craft essences. And you guys might remember from a video a while back I showed you I don't have a lot of four-star servants left to get that wouldn't be doubles. Well, there's an event CE. That's something. Mm. That was a servant pause, but... So we're looking for the rider class guys here with Meb. I don't really consider there that much of a spectacular character, but she's got a new... Spiritron dress that just came out that you that I definitely have enough money to buy so plenty of four stars in this guy So I definitely will go after coup, but they, they all they're all pretty much garbage. None of them are even the event It's not like I expect every four star to be an event CE, but that was a longer pause Is that gonna be good or bad? It is a rider yeah, unless it crackled, we were screwed. It's a rider we don't get very often, that's for sure. All right, guys. So, yeah, it's looking like a very CE-based morning. I'm actually going to take and... Um, I'm going to actually burn some craft essence just to... All right, so we're going to do this. We're going to actually take one of these. And we're going to do a MLB, because we're getting tons of these little buggers. So that's the first thing we're going to do. <clears throat> now this thing is only good for HP, so I don't particularly plan on using it for much of anything. Uh, yeah, now your damage cut is, tw is uh, 200. And I think our critical strength was like only 8% before. I think it's now 10%. So, um, we're going to back up. Uh, what that was not the button I should have hit. So now we're going to do... Oh, yeah, and we did get um, this one yesterday, guys, just for me doing some of the event. I got a nice um, CE, a very nice CE as a reward bonus. Um, even though... Um, I haven't even gotten the card yet. Um, I think you have to buy it in the in the event store. So I was very surprised. All right, so let's get rid of some junk stuff. Yeah, they see. I gotta start getting used to the fact that the button now is choose new craft, choose new craft essence. It used to be back up, I think, but um, yeah, so gotta do some stuff with some cards. Okay, where are you? We just saw you. There you are. There's your junk, crappy, stupid stuff. Uh, anything? I know there's gotta be some other ones. Um. Ironically, I'm getting, I'm trying my chances at want at Ku Alter, and I don't really care. We'll um, we'll use up the rest of these because we kind of, well, no, we can wait and save some of those for a different card. Okay. Um, do I have any other ones? Yes. I would like to do that particular CE too. 
And that might be our last one, and we're also going to burn the rest of our duplicates here at the same time. Yeah, so I have some other videos I got to do this morning, guys, meaning I just have a live broadcast for, um, um, for my Minecraft, so I definitely am not going to take too much longer doing this, that's for sure. We're going to do our, um... Yeah, and I, I'm thinking that something's definitely up with this morning not being good for luck at all. But we're going to go after Ku. Because we did get, I mean, I say that the luck's bad, but we did get a bunch of gold CE on the last one where they could have just said, screw you. So I'm thinking no Ku on this one, but maybe we'll um, get the luck of diminishing returns, basically, meaning we've done so many pulls already this morning that um maybe our luck will change because we spent so much freaking quartz already today um but we'll see <clears throat> i actually don't mind getting that card i need enough to do one more mlb i like to have at least two copies if it's possible of um maxed out new ce's i think a lot of people do Yeah, that was a good pause. Maybe. So we're looking for a Berserker in this one. Frankly, at this point... Well, there's a Berserker right there. Frankly, if we got anything that was gold... Well, with all the times we've been spooked, who knows? I'm starting to think this morning is going to be a total bust as far as getting a servant we want. But, okay, and I got some serious lag there. Ooh. So my tablet's just about as upset at what's going on as I am. <laughs> so far, if I'm not mistaken, I don't think we've even ranked getting a four-star card, have we? Whoop! Oh, we're going to get him! baby diminishing returns today i guess i'll take that why not not bad not bad at all um oh good 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 i i'm almost wishing that maybe i had taken and done the uh tiara or whatever card there i wish i had done that banner last maybe so we could have gotten luck on that but i'm thinking that um we just wouldn't you, you, we didn't know what kind of roles we were gonna have but hey, we got something. Hey, nice. Nice. This is turning out very awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You'd like to chuck in an extra servant or two, I wouldn't be against the idea. And I mean, really high rank ones. But yeah, we'll turn the volume up, guys, because we want to hear him at the end. Oh, here we go. Nice, nice run. <laughs> So, I'm not a big fan of the card as a whole. He's got a very strong Noble Phantasm, I suppose, and the card is overall good, but I've just... A lot of people used to call him one of the, the most powerful Berserkers for a while. Yeah. I don't know. Let's take a look at him, as always, guys. So, Madness of the Spirits, decrease critical rate and attack for all enemies. Not bad. He's just like the regular Koo, where he's got protection from arrows. That's where he's got evade for usually two, two evades over three turns. And I want to say there might be an additional thing, like his critical rate might be up or something. And Battle Continuation, um, this one I think is like, it might be one of those ones where he can, he can last up to have guts over so many turns for like five shots i think he can just like keep taking it keep taking it so divinity c means that he gets damage um he gets damage plus now we're gonna probably try to get him up a little higher so we can use his extra 50 percent attack boost during the uh uh kamakura event and here it is guys i'm not even gonna try to pronounce the name because i'm sure i'll mess it up but increased attack. Um, and then let's see. Uh, and defense. 
for yourself, and then you deal significant damage to one single enemy, which is another reason I'm not a big super fan of him, because he's only a single attacker for his Noble Phantasm. It's not... And it, what is it? It's, it's an anti-personnel, so yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, so I can't remember, but I think it had to do with he was brought about by um, Queen Meb there. I think she wanted like a, she wanted a personality change of some certain thing in Koo, and then she got this Berserker version. So there you go, guys. Strength and NP are both A, and the agility is A+. Plus. So he's, like I said, he's a fairly all-around strong character. Um... That means that, like, if we were to go against him in an event that wanted, like, agility A+, he'd probably be one of the few characters that get listed in that realm. The sprite is very interesting, I can tell you that. I forget what he looks like as he gets ascended, but I don't think it changes a whole lot. Um, but, yeah, the character is not bad, but I'm not going to put it in this spectacular category. By the way, guys, I'm feeling pretty generous. Um, I'm just feeling like I'm in a good mood. So we're going to do a couple quick more enhancements of, um, whoop, we're going to back up here and we're going to, because I like the fact that we got coup, we are going to, uh, try to do a few more things like what we just did. And, um, we are going to go for one more shot at, um, our new event servant, a tiara there. Okay, I really saw that coming. I'm going to try, even though we did just get a super, I'm going to try to do a few more quick things here. We're going to use that before we go. <laughs> you know what's funny, guys? I think I saw that coming. So, uh, you know, almost think I want to keep the run going, but no, I want to take what we've got. And sometimes, like, if you do it back-to-back -back quick enough, sometimes you can get those double supers like that. It's great. Because we're not even doing it during a, any kind of rated-up event. So let's see, guys. It would be a great morning to finally get um, the new Servant, too. We could end up with a total bust, but that's fine. We're actually doing uh, better than I expected. I saw that pause. Is it going to be anything good? I saw, oh, I saw a crackle. It's too bad it's only an assassin, but who, who are we going to get? Now I'm just curious. Ooh, Emiya. Uh, we haven't seen him in a long time. I used to be that I couldn't get him to save my life. So we might only get a crackle servant today, but I guess it's not all bad. He's definitely not MP5 the last I checked. Wow, what an odd five-star to get. So I think we lost the coin flip on this one is probably what happened. So we probably won't get the Servant, but we're not doing bad. I mean, we got a four-star Crackle. We got a five-star CE. We got another four-star CE. Unfortunately, I think we lost the coin flip with the five-star CE, and we probably won't get the five-star Servant, but maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe, just maybe. Oh, I haven't had anything to eat this morning, guys, and I'm just starting to realize it. Re right now, my stomach's telling me, hey, buddy, should have at least had a breakfast bar, and it's like, yes, I should have.
So, not totally bad, but it seems like we more likely got, um... Oh, there you go. NPC and Curse. Huh. Over ten turns. Yeah, wow. Um, that's actually pretty good. Um, I see why it's a five-star card, but the problem is you have to be defeated for it to work. But, um, yeah, all in all, guys, it, I've, I've seen... I've definitely seen worse rolls before, so... Yeah. Heck, we dealt with a few of them yeah, this morning. So, I think we did pretty good with all the rolls, guys. I'm content in what we ended up with. And we already have Ku up to level 36 um, from a back-to-back... Back-to-back um, uh, -back super, so hey, can't knock that. So yeah, we are getting closer, guys. It's so funny, I used to... Just never be able to get that Emia. Now I can trip over him pretty much. So, NP4, baby. It's not a servant we usually use very much. You have to really... You know, you really have to see him more during um, events. So, yeah, we're way over now. Um, we're way, way, way over um, our stuff. You know what I'll do, guys? I'll make you a deal. If we are so lucky... I was, I'm only thinking about this because I really need to get rid of some more cards. Um, we're going to burn off all the extras here at one shot into that five star. If by some stretch of the imagination, I doubt it will happen. So that's why I'm making this little deal. Um, if we get a super or great on that, by some big stretch of the imagination, um, I will roll on that Queen Meb. I will roll the Queen Meb. Yeah, I need to start thinking about lunch and uh, won't have too much time on my um, my uh, Minecraft broadcast when I'm all said and done. I think I might do something unique for my Minecraft broadcast. I was going to have um, some beef stew that my good friend Miss Debbie made, uh, but she texted me up this morning told me that her and her husband uh, both are uh, not feeling so hot after eating it. So I'm... They're, they're not like, they, they might be both coming down with some kind of bug. Um, so I'm going to give it an extra couple days and see what happens. And I think that is all our extra cards. Yeah, okay. Alright. There's going to be a bonus shot, guys, at this. I don't expect it to work any better, but there is one other card in the lineup, guys, that I want to do um, a quick... Well, there's two things, guys, I want to do, actually. Oh, guys, check it out. We can do the last one for this one over here. Let's do that real quick. That was not what I was talking about, but let's do it. It's great. So a couple of bonus things here, guys. Let's see what happens when we MLB this particular card. What are we going to get? It's, it's not often you can MLB a five-star. So what does it increase it to? MP still stays the same, but wow, guys. 2,000 damage over 10 turns. Meaning, guys, if I'm not mistaken, that means that this card now... If I do it and I, my character gets defeated, it will curse all the enemies and they'll take 2,000 damage each turn over 10 turns, guys. That's 20,000 damage. That is that is damn impressive. Damn impressive. So I like that. That is awesome. I might think about using that occasionally. So that is not what I wanted to work on, guys, but I did want to do that real quick. Why not? Um, we are going to MLB, well, we're not going to do an, a total MLB, we're just going to put a few more into, there we go, this one right here, we're going to start running our second one for this card. So this will be the last one, guys, and if a super comes up, we will, you know, do something, but probably not. And there we go. Like I said, it was, and we did two more than I expected, guys, and still nothing. Remember, um, for the Servant, it seemed like it was doing pretty good, but eh, on this, I think we did 
not bad. Not bad. I think we did above um, above average today. So we didn't do we didn't do horrible. We still have a new servant to go for, guys, and we will do something relating to that later on. But I am already a half an hour in, so I'm farther in than I expected for this video. And I definitely want to upload it later as soon as possible. So I'm going to uh, keep it short today, guys, and just thank you all, guys. My viewership on watching these videos has been down, but I'm okay with that. If you're not a subscriber, guys, I would just tell you, hey, I'd love it if you did become a subscriber, but I'm not going to ask you to pound the like button or subscribe or anything like that because I want you guys to do what you want to do. But thank you to anybody who's coming in and checking this out from the outside just to see, um, you know, what's going on, just to see um, what kind of personality I have and how I do my videos and what kind of luck I have. Thank you so much for popping in, guys, and checking on everything. In the meantime, I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend and keep it here, guys, because we will be back to do more rolls. Well, sometime in the future, we'll just have to wait and see. Oh, and just in case anybody's curious. We have enough guys at minimum to do three more rolls. So we will be back at some point to do more of them. Just keep your eyes peeled, everybody. Peace out.